Today, my top five books on actors, and we show off a brand new name and look. Grab a snack and relax. This is Third Mind Thursday. Thank you for joining us. I am your host, Chris Cashin. That's right, Linked is now Third Mind Thursday. Expect all the classics, but also a ton of exciting new content each week. So to all of our returning viewers, as always, thank you for continuing to support us. And to everyone else joining us for the first time, how you doing? Now, acting can be as easy or as tough as you want to make it. Have you ever thought you looked like this? Girl, you must be fried chicken because your finger looking good. Well, let's turn it into this. My darling, your eyes are like two black holes of wonder. They suck the life out of anyone who catches a glimpse. Well, not exactly that. But with these books in no particular order, you are well on your way to creating layered characters based on you and without stereotype. First up, Stella Adler's The Art of Acting. Stella teaches the emotional what-ifs of Stanislavski, widely known in the acting community for his method of creating believable characters. And that makes sense, as she is one of the few American actors to study under him. Stella's school in New York has produced some of the greatest actors in history, like Marlon Brando, Benicio Del Toro, Salma Hayek, Martin Sheen, and Robert De Niro. German native Uta Hagen in her book A Challenge for the Actor is up next. Uta emphasizes realism by finding the characters you play in yourself, using six steps to develop meaningful breathing lives on stage and screen. Now why Hagen? She was an actress herself, originating the role of Martha on Broadway in Who's Afraid of Virginia Woolf, and winning several awards, including two Tonys and an Emmy nomination. A Challenge for the Actor is her second book, but you can also check out her first book, Respect for Acting. Next, Howard Fine's Fine on Acting. Fine is a colleague of Hagen himself and has worked with big names like Chris Pine, Brad Pitt, Bradley Cooper, and Will Smith. His book goes deeper into the Hagen technique through finding the character within yourself and creating personal relationships. Fine covers common mistakes actors make and even answers some of those challenging questions like dealing with emotional scenes, working with bad actors, and memorizing lines. Howard also is the founder of the Howard Fine Acting Studio in Hollywood, which if you live or visit LA, definitely go check out. And be sure to audit his master class, which you can do for free each Monday. Up next, and another excellent coach with her own school in LA, is Margie Haber in her book, How to Get the Part Without Falling Apart. Margie's key focus is auditions, and her phrase technique for auditioning is one of the best I have used and I still use today. Now, Haber's technique is best learned rather than read, so if you can attend her classes or one of her two-week intensives, definitely do it. She also travels around the country and the world doing seminars and weekend master classes. You can find out more on her website, margiehaber.com. The last book on my list is Ivana Chubbuck's The Power of the Actor. The Chubbuck Technique is another excellent method to build real, genuine characters, using 12 steps to find objectives, obstacles, beats, and inner monologue. My personal favorite step is her last and is solid advice for any technique. After the homework, let it go. So there you have it, my current top five books for beginning actors. I've added links to each of the books in the description box below, so go check out all the goodness. Of course, these are my top five and there are many other great reads out there. But always remember, reading is never as good as doing, so be sure to get out there, look around in your local area, maybe at a school or community theater if you live in a smaller town, and start practicing all that knowledge you've just gobbled up. So that's all for today. Be sure to subscribe to us for more thoughts and entertainment, and be sure to follow me on Twitter as I'll be posting other great books to sync those acting canines into over the next few days. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next week. So much to say. Fine. So much to say. Oh, God. If you saw what I was seeing right now. <laughs> crying. I'm just going to do this a paragraph at a time. We're just one line at a time. We'll get it out.